All right, welcome back to the Tangerine Podcast. We do to do. I got my dog T So J K here. You feel me? And I promise you, if you see, I got the same clothes on. I wash my ass. I promise you. So just tell that out to the camera. So introduce yourself. You feel me? What Dennis said. My name is J K. I'm from Palm Beach County, Rivera Beach. You feel me? Uh, I'm an up and coming rapper. Um, yeah, pretty much. Hello. So, uh, where did you say you would grow up? Riviera, Palm Beach County, yeah. and everything. Yeah. Where else have you lived, you know, from your whole life and whatnot? Oh, uh, I recently just came from South Dakota. I was staying up for a couple of years. Yeah. Yeah, no cap. Um, it's better living for people like, um, you know, black people or whatnot, you know, in the yeah. city folks. It's real good for people like that. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot, like, you can, you can really put your life in a proper way standpoint up there, you know what I'm saying, but, uh, yeah, I was just up in South Dakota, uh, you know what I'm saying, I ain't gonna disclose where I'm at right now, but, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I won't get my drop, but, nah, for real, no, of course. Um, <laughs> for real, um, I be on Palm Beach, though, for the most part. So what do you feel like, you know, what are some things you feel like you, how do you feel like you grew, what do you feel like you learned being in South Dakota for a bit? Um, I mean... It really opened up my eyes with culture, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? You can take the nigga out of the streets, but you can't take the streets out of tight shit. Yeah. I'm not really around. You wasn't, you know, it's not really us up there, if you know what I'm saying. Like, uh-huh. the, the folks up there is, like, kind of not, like, culture or up to date like we is. Like, they're still using Snapchat, you know what I'm saying? Oh, like, damn, God. Snapchat. Damn. I still got, I got Snapchat, too, but, like, that's damn. a main type of uh, communication damn. on, on social media. They don't even believe in Instagram. They be like, I got an Instagram, but I don't even use it, you know mm. what I'm saying? So, Everybody be on Instagram every fucking day, Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Man. It's it's like it's it's like still trying to talk on like a message on like kick or some shit like that. Yeah. Like that's like damn. Yo, hold up. For real, <laughs> like shit crazy. I had a bitch post me on uh Snapchat like on some on some like trying to like bash me on some, you know, hating shit, on some play hate shit. Uh-huh. So a bitch sent the shit to me. I'm like, what the fuck I'm supposed to do? That's Snapchat. I don't be on Snapchat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't be on Snapchat. Like, what Who the, the fuck? fuck? That shit, man. Listen, the fuck? there's like, only one reason you Snapchat. We, we ain't got to say why. But listen, you beating like, something. You feel me? Yo, That's the only reason. That was, you feel me? You trying, to, you trying to, you know what I'm saying? You yeah. trying to get your product out of there. You feel me? Yeah. Even that, they take and, you and, you know, That's it. That's, that's it. it. That's Literally. It. A nigga not finna be out there posting... Four, oh. five fucking stories. Like, the shit, le- the shit leaves after 24 hours anyway, so nope. Um, like, like ten, 10 things that are interesting every fucking day is crazy. You know what I mean? Like, right. it's like, I'll do, like, that shit is outdated. We got Instagram stories. Like, I don't know. I don't know, man. They got to get together. Good reason why, <laughs> Um, one of the main reasons why I left from up there, you know what I'm saying? But... On a good note, though, they got a lot of jobs, you know what I'm saying? They got a lot of platforms for, like, people, any field you're trying to get in. Except for the music-wise, you know what I'm saying? They kind of, they kind of, it's an L on that lane. But for the most part, like, if you trying to, like, do a career? have a career, go anywhere far in your life type shit, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. Like, it's easy to get up there that's, and, that's and get right, you know what I'm saying? It's just, like, music only is, it's more of, like, a gateway to bullshit. You feel me? You get surrounded by the bullshit. You get surrounded by the hype, drugs, everything. You feel me? And even people trying to take advantage of you for the most part. You ain't lying. You ain't lying. Okay, so you feel me? You getting in the trade, bitch. You learning shit from around people. You meeting different people. You feel me? You start meeting executives of different businesses and shit. You learning shit. You feel me? Like, I feel like it's a totally different thing. You feel me? From music to careers. You're right. You, you're right. Because, you know what I'm saying? That's... Music is not like a career, like, you know what I'm saying? You can't... It's more like a hobby. That's like, like something you can... That's something you can learn, you know what I'm saying? Or like mm-hmm. a gift, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't got to go to school for no shit like that, you no. know what I'm saying? But, yeah. But, what we talking about? What we talking about? Oh no no you're yeah, saying we were talking about what you did up there no 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 that's what, yeah. what it was like yeah that's yeah, so you answered that shit. Like yeah was, yeah yeah why did you start making music I ain't gonna lie I've been rapping for a minute like I've been doing this shit since like 
I don't even remember since I couldn't even <laughs> remember. You know what I'm saying? Not even necessarily rapping, but on like even just playing with tunes, you know, singing, you know what I'm saying? Running around the house humming, whatnot. Everybody be like, yeah, you know, he going to be the, the, the musician one in the family when he get older. You know what I'm saying? So I've been doing this for a long time. Even in elementary, I was on a talent show. You know what I'm saying? I was like the first JIT on uh, elementary, like, Rap on stage, you know what I'm saying? I ain't came on that bit freestyling, shit. Ain't know what the hell I was doing, but I had sparked a lot of people's minds, and they were like, you know what I'm saying? Shit got a gift, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I've been doing that like you could probably say like ten years now, you know what I'm saying? Damn. Wow. But I like really taking this music seriously and like um actually getting my music on like product. Or what not on like streaming? I say like twenty twenty. Um, I say twenty twenty two. I kind of started taking it seriously. Right? Like I dropped my first song on SoundCloud. What not twenty twenty two? That was and that was a solo or what was um, was that with somebody? Your first song. Um, my first song. I think it was uh, "Senseless Flow." It was like call that black remix, mm. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I had a remix oh, that. I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that shit actually did on um, some numbers. Um, but that was the first time I ever posted. You know what I'm saying? I ended up getting uh curled like not too long later, like two weeks later. You know what I'm saying? But that was like the first song I had dropped. You know, I don't need. I'm like play with Cardi with the shit. Like I drop a song. And then disappear type shit. You know what I'm saying? Long. And that's what's trying to fuck me up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, People it's, like, the, it's the inconsistency. It's inconsistency. I wouldn't even say inconsistently. I'm not really feeling like... Like, I'll post a trailer or whatnot and leave a bit hanging. You know what I'm saying? Like, people won't be like, damn, like, when is it coming? When is it coming? Yeah, man, like... It's all inconsistency, man. I ain't gonna lie. Mm-hmm. But I had to face that same theory because I'm just like, bro, I could come back, you feel me? I ain't even have triggers ready. I ain't even have a song, you feel me? You used to do the post it at your convenience, though. You feel me? And then that shit puts you back because you got all the competition out here and people feeling for more music every day. No, they might as well get bro back in the camera. Uh, you know what the hell you talking about? Real shit. Real shit. Man, nah, he right though, hundred percent. Um, the inconsistency that can come from anywhere. Definitely with the gym, I like just everything. Feel like people don't appreciate my art. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. I wouldn't say people don't like fuck with nigga. On, like on a music standpoint, I wouldn't even say that. You feel me? I feel like I kind of influence. You know what I'm saying? Few few rappers out there on Palm Beach, you know what I'm saying, that doing this shit right now. You know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't even say that. I just feel like people in Palm Beach aren't really like in tune with my music or my sound. Everybody on this fake drill shit and they being misled by a lot of these fuck niggas out here in the city. Cause y'all out here thinking these niggas out here smacking. Truth be told, these fuck niggas out here ain't got no work. Real shit. And this shit going from like on a real standpoint, knowing these niggas personally, like y'all niggas out here fool, bro. Like these niggas just, you, you, you know what I'm saying? Like, got hats or whatever, you feel me? Yeah, fuck, like, nigga. Like, I feel that, like, you feel me? But. Niggas out here be flagging and, you know what I'm saying, folks be sheeps, you know what I'm saying? Everybody following after what's popping right now, you know what I'm saying? So, that's what kind of made me, like, hesitant, but at the same time, I'm not, I'm a, I don't give a fuck type of nigga. I don't care, like, if you fuck with nigga or not, you know what I'm saying? It's just, I just wait, you know what I'm saying? That's probably, like, my problem. I just, I just, I'm just waiting, you know what I'm saying? But I'm, I plan on dropping the EP or some shit. Soon, you know what I'm saying? I got like cover art, whatnot. I got like a little, you know what I'm saying? I just, I'm just waiting on a good time. For yeah, just let me know. We gonna, direction, I'm, we gonna promote, saying? we gonna promote that. For Definitely, sure. I appreciate I'm, that. I'm gonna at least try to try to help, see what I can do I on some shit. That. That promote that. Uh, how many songs roughly do you think I'm out or you don't even have all that detail uh, yet? I ain't gonna roughly. lie, cause like I'm getting these features out of the way. You know what I'm saying? I was big on not doing features with nobody. I'm not friendly. I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't like being in. You know what I'm saying? And like like what bro was saying earlier, you do a feature with a nigga type shit. Mm-hmm. And I done did it in the past. I done did a feature with a nigga and these niggas be having batteries on their back. 
You know what I'm saying? Having yeah, other yeah, niggas yeah. tell them what to do type shit. I'll be having war yeah, daddies yeah, and shit. shit so, so you yeah, like feel me? So hard, you feel yeah. me? Y'all, y'all let nigga face like y'all fuck with nigga. You feel me? Then you got your, you feel me? Your war daddy telling you, oh, don't drop it with, bro. Woo, 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 on some controversy shit. They ain't got nothing to do with, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So now nah, it's, the nigga I done did music with, he on some shit like, okay, he, he ain't trying to go against the grain, you know what I'm saying? But he ain't trying to be a fuck, you feel me? He ain't gonna drop it, he ain't gonna promote it, you feel me? It's that shit just, just like, goes with the wind. That's just going to win, you know what I'm saying? And that's like, it's a waste of your time. that's a waste of my time and really like, shy me away from, you know what I'm saying, socializing and working with artists in the city, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I really believe Palm Beach is doomed for that shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we, like, niggas be over here dick around who, uh, niggas opinion, you feel me, because that's their dog or whatever, you feel me? And at the end of the day, you got your own saying and shit, like, okay, if y'all don't fuck with them, like, okay, that's different. But you don't fuck with this nigga off for nothing nigga say, so you feel me? I can get that, like, you know, you down behind, you feel me, how he moving, but like if you over here just moving whatever his opinion he's stating to you, you feel me? Like you you his dog on command, bitch. Real shit. So that shit didn't yeah, look bad, bitch. And what if and who's to say that song you couldn't have blow up off that shit? Who's to say that? You feel me? Now you done. Yeah, now you done fucked up. Missed out on the opportunity. You feel me? But yeah. hey, man, you blocked your blessing. Fucking nigga. You feel me? But. Like I was saying, though, um, I'm just working on these features right now. You know what I'm saying? Getting all those plays right. You know what I'm saying? I got like a few. Shout out Hondo Hondo. Um, I'm trying to get something with uh, One Way Youngin right now. I'm about to send an open verse. But um, once I, you feel me? Yeah. I got bruh. Um, shout out Jable the Prince. Shout out J4. You feel me? I got some music with them boys. Um... Who else I got middle with? I got a middle with a few rappers. Um, shout out Kid with Tech. That's my favorite feature right now. Hey, Glacier too. Yeah, I ain't did a song with him though, but he, you feel I me? School with the boys. Tight shit. You feel? Me? Oh, yeah. Those the nigga I forgot to shout out, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Shit. But you feel me? Um, yeah, Kid with Tech probably like my 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 favorite feature right now. You know what I'm saying? Outside the music, I kind of deal with my little brother, though. You feel me? Shout out to Drippy. You feel me? Bruh, really had, like, for, like, a little phase in Palm Beach, bruh. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. Little bruh had. He was going up. He was going he up. That nigga was sliding. Bro, he even, bro. She did with you. Yeah, you bro, feel me? Like, he remade that shit. You feel me? I was just like, what the fuck? Then he had his own little shit to it. And I was like, bro, he started doing videos. He was doing good. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. then he started getting caught up in the bullshit. And it was just like, I seen it coming only because of the fact of how he was going about it. Because, yeah, you ain't power. You feel me? You ain't finna go for nothing. But at the end of the day, it's just like, you know, you got to watch for your image. You feel me? You got to protect yourself. Even if it means, you feel me, your own image and how you move still. That's how I thought about it. You feel me? I I know more about the situation on like, I know the, the back end. You feel me? But you you know what I'm saying? You ain't, you ain't wrong for like how you you viewing it. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, found got you know what I'm saying? Free found. You know what I'm saying? Played. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Trying to fuck them over. You feel me? But besides, I I feel like I'm getting off topic. Um, LeBron. You know what I'm saying? Me and my feet with LeBron. Yeah, kid with Tech. That's probably like my favorite one right now. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I got. Cover, I'm probably gonna call the shit Pay the Fool, you know what I'm saying? And um, Ooh, yeah, I got a video to a song called Pay the Fool, too. So I was gonna be like one of the stars, yeah, yeah, shit. yeah, yeah, that makes you know sense. What I'm so, um, I'm probably gonna drop some shit sometime, like, um, probably like my birthday time, you know what I'm saying? My guy, I done lost my Instagram. Oh, my birthday, November, In November, yeah, okay, so, okay, yeah, hell yeah, yeah, um, so I'm probably finna. By then, I'm gonna have my clout back, right? You know what I'm saying? Hello. My algorithm and shit, because, you know, they took my page and shit on some goofy shit while I was locked up. So, um, yeah, I didn't been really networking on this page, and this page growing. You know what I'm saying? I like this page. You know what I'm saying? This shit doing some good traction type of shit. So, by then, my shit should be at, like, I'm consistently getting, like, over 14K on my videos and shit. So, by then, dropping an EP or some shit okay. is, like, normal. You know what I'm saying? I'll help you but grow. I'm not type of nigga. I don't mm-hmm. like to rush the process. So, I like to... They let me be great real quick. You know what I'm saying? Let yeah. me be great. You feel me? But, yeah. That's real. How do you feel about, um, recently, the, the death of Fulio and whatnot? Damn, I ain't even gonna lie to you, fam. 
No, I don't know the nigga personally, but regardless of that, the man had an impact. Like, it did. you can say what you want about Fulu, but you cannot take away uh, the movement bruh had, like, and what he did, and like the Jacksonville scene. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He was one of the first, like, artists. Like, I heard from, from Jacksonville, you know what I'm saying? Before I heard the Young Ace, I heard of Fulio first. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Whether who blew up I was first, seeing, I was honestly seeing his face before I even seen his music. I'm yeah. like, I don't know who the fuck is. You feel me? You feel like, me? I seen who his face before. Fulio, yeah. yeah. Like, my brother used to tell me about the Fulio. I'm like, what the fuck? You know, I was more big on who got the most views when I was legit. So, he ain't nice. reaching certain views. Nice. Yeah, I wasn't tapping in with you, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I had to get out that era, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, so I was overlooking a lot of rappers. But when I got locked up 2019, I had to do my little in the ground type shit. Mm-hmm. You, I'm surrounded by a lot of niggas from, from that way, you know what I'm saying? Duval, Jacksonville. So mm-hmm. this be like people in his clip. This is yeah, they people, dogs and shit. Man, you know knew, knew of him. Sure. So they put me on ja- um, Fulio and shit. So I'm like, damn, bruh, slotting. You know what I'm saying? Bruh had a bid, like. Impact on me when I was locked up, ain't gonna lie, early 2021, uh, um, 2022, when he dropped, you know what I'm saying, going back to back with the dishes with Young Names, that shit yeah, was wild. It's crazy. Me, you know what I'm saying? Like, bruh had niggas from around his way, around our way, smoking on these niggas, you know what I'm saying? These niggas, yo. You feel me? You feel me? Like, bruh had niggas turn, niggas spinning in his music, you feel me? Don't, like, you feel me? Don't you dare, like, a nigga don't, like... This, like the nigga, you feel me? Ain't had niggas out there trying to get groovy and shit. Nah, bro, bro, yo, bro, that nigga. He made his nah, impact. Me, I, the same way, I give it a, I give it, fam, bro. You feel me, bro? Solidify himself while he was still on the earth, but how his movement was, I ain't agree with everything he was doing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he pulled up to other places trying to low key. You feel me? Yeah. Like this and the dad and shit. That shit got karma with it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Man, I, I, I'm, I'm. I really like I'm based off like energy and shit. What you put out to the world is is reciprocated and brought back to you. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So you out Hell. there pushing, you know, and pushing this negativity, all this dark this shit, shit. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That shit gonna come back to you. And you mind, I'm watching this man Instagram page. I used to follow the man, and whatnot. So it's like all you seeing is nigga talking about as I as is 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 death or jail. That's all on your conscience. It's like damn. It's like. Maybe you want to be, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what the nigga was going through in his mind before he, but, you know what I'm saying? He kind of, kind of played, you know what I'm saying? He played. Well, well played. the craziest thing to me about it was that. Dropping locations and shit. Yeah, doing that. And you're not even in your own city to be even trying to pull them type of moves. But that's what, that's like, what goes back to what I was saying. Maybe nigga just wanted to die. Like, nigga just don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Nigga done been shot so many times. Nigga yeah, like, he got he been shot at point. like he been shot at like ten times. This shit is like, crazy. And then not even all not even all in his own city. I remember he had got shot in Houston. I think they got him in the leg or some shit like that. Shit was crazy. Like it's a curse, man. It's, a, it's I feel like it's it's just a it's like I don't know what type of me. I don't know what type of like obviously that's some street shit that I'm not I don't know to but it's like damn them type of ops is crazy. That supposedly, most likely, they done came from Jacksonville or something like that to get him. Because I don't know what kind of beef he would be really starting in Tampa. Hopefully. I, I know, know he was dropping loads and desperate, shit, but damn. You know, he was, some people desperate. You know? People take that three-hour drive to get, get to him. You know what I'm saying? And y'all acting like Tampa is just... Like not central, like you know what I'm saying. That's, that's, literally central Florida. that's really central Florida, like you know what I'm saying. Tampa and Jacksonville, like a nigga you know is probably out there migrating out there in Tampa. You, you, you feel me? He you probably had an all out there f- floating out there. Yo, bro, out there dropping low, got all these niggas around you and shit. Probably moving militant, you know what I'm saying? That's why you know, I'm like fucking. With Everybody, I am be with like a tight number of people because niggas, you have it's, a snake around you the whole time. It's, it's, and I honestly feel like a nigga got snaked out. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna wrap it up on bro because this, this, you know what I'm saying? This, of course, this is about me type shit. Of but course, not, like, but I just feel like if if I was like somebody that had that type of audience or whatnot, like I think about like what happened to like um, and then PMB it? Rock, like PMB Rock, PMB how we got Rock. killed at the he thing. Ain't he ain't deserve it, at but all. it's he like. Well, when you know you at a certain status, I'm a post. I will post once I'm gone. 
But once you oh, know you shit. at a certain status, yeah, you, you, know, you, you, you supposed to be moving a certain type of way. You cannot move like you a, 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 a regular, regular nigga. ass nigga and mm-hmm. you not doing regular shit. You feel me? If you know you selling out shows and shit, you know what I'm saying? You you you, you working with multi-million dollar, billion dollar people. At least you what the fuck you out here you. with your bitch? You know what I'm saying? Out here in, in LA. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, LA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. LA. You feel some, me? Some chicken and, chicken and waffle place or whatever. You feel me? Yeah. Out here trying to be cool, guy with your bitch. Got your ass whack. You know what I'm saying? No, it's, a, it's a very unfortunate. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. My tone a little, might be a little too hard, but at the same time, that's just how I feel, hundred percent. You can't be moving like that and expect nothing to happen to you. Like you, you gotta move like the president with the right shit. If you don't, yeah, gonna get plucked. Yeah, you you know see all these niggas out here dying. Yeah. From the streets too. So it's just like he. It, it's, it was well expected to know what's up, whatever city, state you be in. Real shit. You're not gonna be out there not know what the fuck going on. Facts. But I ain't really never really heard no PNB rock on no step of shit like. He ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't never heard yeah, of like in the hood. Yeah. He from yeah. the, might be from the from the hood, but I ain't I ain't. You feel me? Mm-hmm. I ain't. I gotta do my research. Yeah, but how do you feel about signing deals? How like the deals are done in the music industry? Obviously, a lot of artists have signed uh, bad contracts, bad deals for themselves. You know, what would be a situation in which you would sign, or you know? What do you feel like some mistakes people make when signing to a label or whatnot? Uh, I mean, labels. Um, I mean, labels really do target after like low, you know what I'm saying, low class, like artists that just got like uh, talent, you know what I'm saying, because you can easily like manipulate them. You mm-hmm. know, you you take a nigga like me from the hood, dirt like I, like I'm not broke no shit like that, but like. A nigga throw in your face three hundred thousand, you know what I'm saying? A that big shit one. Is that ain't it's nothing, something. but like, you, you know what I'm saying? Yo, you feel me? Like you throw some shit out to a nigga, you feel me? An artist, a it's nigga like, gonna want to take that, you know what I'm saying? Me? You, you ain't never seen no shit like that, so so. How's that? How's that? You feel me? So like a lot of artists be like, I don't know, like gullible. You can say. You know what I'm saying? And like, don't be reading through. They just see a digit and you don't even know. You don't even get half of that. You know what I'm saying? Shit get taken out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 30%. You management, the label, get a percentage of that. You know what I'm saying? They break down so, and then that's your money to do Rappers every... be broke as fuck. You know what I'm saying? And then so, 30% get divided between the cost that you had to cover between your little shit and other shit. And you ain't even know that. And that was on your paperwork. You feel me? Niggas don't be seeing that. And it be in the whole 360 deal. Damn. Damn. Like, he know, he know, he know something. You feel me, bro? Insightful, but mm-hmm. yeah, like. What would it take for what would it, what would it take for you personally to sign a deal? I sign mean, on that dollar line. I don't mind the independent route. Give me a distribution deal, and um, I'll be straight with that. Or like a marketing deal, I'll be straight with that. Mm-hmm. But like, you know, you talking right? A label talking right? I done had a couple deals come my way. Um, since doing this shit, but they wasn't talking right. So, like, what we talking about? Yeah, type shit. Exactly. So, yeah. Man, it sounded like it was finna. Yeah. It wasn't finna work yeah, out. Yeah, just you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying. Don't hand me no no fault, nigga. Shit, no three sixty shit on no poor ass thirty pounds, forty pounds. Like, come on, nah, I'm a, like, no. And more than likely, no. the contract if it's more than, if it's like thirty forty bands the shit on no like, local shit. No, I never signed for no shit like that. Maybe it's like a major label, Atlantic you know or saying? something some like that. Like that, and it's on some like developmental, a developmental deal because this deal is like they'll sign you for like a year. Or two, you feel me? You can get uh, out this or do whatever you want. They'll drop an album. You know what I'm saying? See how much money you make from that. The money you made from that, you give it back to the label, and hopefully another label can then, then heard your shit and then and, and you feel me? You can go from there. That's that's usually how it is. So like, hi, Boston Richie. What you mean? For example, like with the label shit, you feel me? Like he was doing good. I don't know. Ain't gonna that nigga troll as fuck. So I stopped keeping up with him once some paperwork came out. Nah, 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 facts. But you feel me? Like how he came up with the label shit, you feel me? Like after a certain point, he was doing it by himself. I believe. I'm not sure. And then to a point, he got a good label. You feel me? He had more than a hundred mil on the table for offer. You feel me? So like that's what I'm saying. 
Sign a nigga for a hundred mil? Hell, that nigga. <laughs> nah, man. Probably like 10 mil. 20 mil, probably. 100 mil? Hell, yeah. nah. That nigga, nah. That nigga sound like that. Like 10. Must be trying to sign a nigga for 10 years. Because it just nah, sounds like. trash, man. And, ain't just, gonna lie. and it just sounds like it would just be getting like real ugly once, once like. Um, money wise, out, money wise, and numbers wise, you not holding up your end, or you feel me? And then they start not wanting to drop your music. They start not wanting to release your EPs and albums and shit like that. It'd be getting like real grimy. Cause at the end of the day, like I feel like a lot of them are like alone on some shit. Definitely, it's really be like investments. Like literally, literally that's what it is. Like. Investing in you, they want any money back. <laughs> so, oh, hello. So. How do you feel about the state, you know, of the Palm Beach rap scene? You feel me? Palm Beach rap scene, the whole South Florida. I'm gonna ask you the same thing on some shit. How do you feel about it as How a whole? How do you feel about it? I feel like there's really a lot of talent out here. There really is. It's just, I don't know what it's gonna take for us to. Really get on that level, maybe have our moment in the sun, because I feel like it's coming. I'm very, I'm very optimistic about it. I really believe it's coming. I've worked with so many different artists on the pod or just in the studio, been invited to the studio just to chill on some shit. I'm not a, you know, I'm not an artist. I haven't made a song or no shit like that. But I would like to be on one one day, by the way. But. That's another story for another day. But yeah, I just want to make like one song, yeah. play that shit forever, retire, have that shit blow up, retire. <laughs> but yeah, I feel that's, like that's there. A good way to do it. Too. Yeah, but I really, I really feel like there really is a lot of talent from the whole county, um, whole county down south, my uh, Broward, Miami, all that. I really feel like there's a lot of talent out here, and we just got to realize it really. Um, Definitely. Move the right way, just. Be businessman. Be do what you say you're gonna do. Um, do what you gotta do. Pay for the marketing. Do what you, you know. Come up with a budget, and see what happens. You feel me? Like for a lot of people, it's really, it's not gonna work out to make it like your full time income on some shit. Like, but I mean, you gotta live out your dream. You gotta damn sure try. You gotta you damn sure try your try. damn best. I what? Mean- if that's something you passionate about, something that you really stand on, something that you really want to do, of course, nah, keep going for it. Of course, facts, facts, facts. I feel like a lot of people like don't really want to work together on some shit. But hopefully, like if we get to one person at a time, we could promote a culture of just hopefully working together, settling differences and whatnot, bullshit, and get to the money. Definitely. If nothing definitely. else, sure. so. Nah, I definitely to answer your question. Um. How I feel about the um, Florida scene right now, I'm gonna speak for like Palm Beach. Uh, due to like a lot of beef in the city, like a lot of talent is like clouded. You know what I'm saying? And like a lot of people be hot in love, like you know what I'm saying, showing fake love with this shit. But a lot of people be like hot in love with the, with the music shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like people be scared to show support in Palm Beach. You know what I'm saying? Like I like I said earlier. Whatever's popping right now, you know what I'm saying? They gonna flop, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I don't really feel like this the, the scene gonna get any better. It's been like this for years, you know what I'm saying? And, like, if you don't see no change in this shit going on right now in Palm Beach, I don't think I'm ever gonna see it. And I don't, I don't care. I don't mind it. You feel me? I don't give a fuck to if a nigga fuck me or not. I don't... I didn't start rapping to impress another nigga. I can do a whole this shit by myself with no feature. You feel me? But nah, this shit is corrupted down here, bro. It's it's wicked, and this shit really do gotta stop. Tell you the truth, ain't no type of unity in Palm Beach County. I ain't gonna lie to you. That's why a lot of rappers that blow up in Palm Beach they get out of the city. And they don't, and they don't never come back. You, you know what I'm saying? Every time. I didn't, I didn't seen it because them, them, the rappers that still do that's in blew up and they're still in Palm Beach County. Them niggas, right. them they broke as fuck. Nah, they broke as fuck. And they ain't gonna say nobody name. You feel me? But you feel me? That shit is fat. Them, them, them boys broke as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Look at fuck it. Look at Jit man, bruh. 
Fucking nigga. That man. Yeah, and I grew up, and I grew up with this nigga, bro. Like, this was like my son when I was a shit, fam. Like, fat. Crazy. You feel me? Like, who is he, fam? Like, in my opinion, I was just like who he was at the time. I just seen he got a lot of followers, fam. I was yeah, really cause uh, the shit he do is goofy as fuck. Like I don't know if niggas, you could niggas be clowning and shit, but you know, like that shit. It, it's 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 a section for goofy. It's a specific section for goofy niggas. Some people sign that shit hard, but like I'm been, bro. That shit is embarrassing, bro. Like, cause like you you niggas get opportunity to to, to change our lives forever. You your whole family. And you wanna be, you wanna, you wanna get drugged by broke ass niggas from this city. You feel me? That that ain't going nowhere. You feel me? That's nowhere. really using you to get on a platform. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas really be lost in it. Whatever shit they, they have them feel comfortable, have them feel like they smack you, feel me? Like have them feel like they safe and this this gangster image, they can continue doing this shit because you got niggas behind them. You know what I'm saying? Like. Yeah, but y'all niggas be broke, fam. And y'all, it's 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 in in the face. Like you can see that shit, bro. I'm not just talking. Like you can just see the shit. Like the fuck, y'all niggas pitiful, bro. I'd be really like embarrassed for certain certain shit, fam. I feel like we got a lot of good fam, but there's the island boys and shit. Fam. I can oh name, my I God, can name, fam. I can go, I can go like real shit. Cause like I view the shit. I, of course, I gotta view the shit. I'm a rapper. You feel me from the city, so I'm I'm, I'm viewing all this, this this fuck shit playing out in the city, and and, and 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 the music like this shit is like I don't know, but somebody gotta do it. You can't hate a nigga because them boys, because them boys on the platform now. Of course, you know. What I'm of saying? course, so you gotta give a nigga their credit. Bro. No, of course for doing their thing. Of course, of course, but it's just like damn, like some of this shit, like like you said, some goofy shit and be doing. Shit, it's like man. it's it's embarrassing on some shit, like. Damn. I don't know. Anybody could be a rapper nowadays. Hey, them niggas kissing. Literally. All you gotta do is have an image, man. You <laughs> niggas out here kissing their brothers in the lips, all type fucking, of shit. Your pocket hurting that bad. You out here doing celibate, satanic ass shit, unholy ass, wicked ass shit. You losing your yeah. morals and shit Selling to make a couple stuff. dollars and shit. Like these niggas out here really real deal selling their soul. You know what I'm saying? Like, like this shit be sick, man. This shit is wicked, bro. Like. That's why I stay on my lane. I make my music and I'm on my business, bro. So I'm taking my album. You know smoke my shit, go home. Like I just mind <laughs> my business, bro. Like that's all I'm. That's what I'm gonna get from this. Hold on, I believe my. But yeah, as we approach the end of it, um, anything else you wanted to talk about? You wanted to speak on? Um, Any words of encouragement? People who listen to your shit who really um, fuck with you as a person, listen to your shit, whatnot. Most definitely, you know what I'm saying? I'm a very genuine person. I'm laid back, you know what I'm saying? Like, just keep me out of drama, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm going to stand on business. Of course. You know what I'm saying? For sure, 100%. But, you know what I'm saying? I'm laid back, you know what I'm saying? If you an artist out there on Palm Beach, you know what I'm saying? Up and coming, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Trying to work, you know what I'm saying? Network, whatnot, you know what I'm saying? I'll be down to work, you know what I'm saying? I'm not no too fancy ass nigga. And I didn't hit numbers. Or what not, you know what I'm saying? But I never been that type to to let numbers, you know what I'm saying, just big head me or make me feel like I'm better than the community when I'm not, you know what I'm saying? Cause there's a lot more people out there that's 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 doing it harder than me, you know what I'm saying? No, you can do a salute them boys, you know what I'm saying? But right is right, real is real, you know what I'm saying? I, I call that shit out. But um, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I would like to say also to a lot of the rappers upcoming rappers in, in the city, you know what I'm saying? Like, just keep doing you, you know what I'm saying? Do not be like none of these other niggas, bro. Do not try to reiterate another 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 rapper flow, they style, be unique. That's going to sell, you know what I'm saying? I was just talking to my sister about this earlier today, you know what I'm saying? Branding and marketing, you know what I'm saying? Like, rappers like ASAP Rocky and shit, you know what I'm saying? Them boys came out. You know what I'm saying? They them boys had brand they self. You know what I'm saying? They they he made it off of brand himself, being himself, being a pretty boy. Came out there, you know what I'm saying? All in the fashion. So me saying that is to say that, bro, you you can make it far just by, you know what I'm saying? Staying true to your skin. You know what I'm saying? Never forget the path. No forget it. You know what I'm saying? No forget the objective. You know what I'm saying? Oh, well, you gotta be the best you. Which is to strive and 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 and, and, and get this music out there. You know what I'm saying? But that's how I'm feeling. 
You know what I'm saying? I, I hope I'm not missing nothing out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, take care of your mentals. Keep going. You feel me? Budget it. Oh, you feel and me? one thing, one more thing. <laughs> one more thing, man. Get you a team, man. If you out here rapping and you trying to do this independently in Palm Beach County, get you a team. Get you a group of people that's like-minded and that's on the same mindset as you, you know what I'm saying? And 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 set up a team. Whether you got a homeboy that know how to that know how to do this internet shit hard and know how to network, get get a get a nigga specifically for that. You know what I'm saying? Get you a homeboy that know how to uh 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 goddamn shoot music videos or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Get you a homeboy that know how to do vlogs, whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Soon later you done got six, seven people that's out here striving to succeed with you. And y'all done you done made yourself for the team. You know what I'm saying? That's the mindset I'm at right now. Two of the rap shit, you know what I'm saying? Definitely, you know what I'm saying? Have a legitimate, strong team that's 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 trying to see me win, you know what I'm saying? Cause I got a lot of people around me that support me. Um like business wise, you know what I'm saying, that really wanna see me win and I like to, you know what I'm saying, uh uh give you your your your, your credit, you know, your pro you know what I'm saying. I appreciate you for having me come out here to your uh your your podcast or whatnot. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um Cause me running the hill, look, I done network, running to a uh, broad here, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you feel me? You ain't need no, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? See how God work, you know what I'm saying? So I like to say, man, get you a team and network to the best of your ability, man. Real shit. J Way, man. Ain't he got nothing else to say, raw weight, man. Free my little brother, man. Free Drippy, man. Free 2 3, man. All right, that's everything. Let's wrap this up. You feel me? I appreciate T S O J K having uh, them on. You T feel me? T S O J K. Y'all always say with shit like the chicken. It's how chicken and shit like for real. T S O J K. I got you, man. Yeah, but thanks for being on and everything. Oh, for sure, for sure, man. Oh, good. I was straight. I ain't the whole ain't bad for something. Nah, I ain't going wrong. You good? And then yeah, and then I definitely.